Hello everybody. Today, I am pretty sure I figured out how to fix the issue of the DLSS must be disabled in the video settings in Fortnite. Because it could make your character look really pixelated and not good. So like I'm going to go into the settings and it says it like it won't let me raise my three resolution or my anti aliasing but and it just makes your character look super bad and pixelated and it's not good it's not like I'm playing around with it you can't fix it but in a minute and I'll show you how to fix it alright so I use Razer Cortex as a game booster to make my games a lot faster, and I would recommend it because it works fairly well in boosting your FPS to the game's potential. You can like do that. But the real thing we're here for is Booster Prime. In Booster Prime, it shows all these games that can be boosted good, but there's a problem. See, when you click on it, this is the real reason that it says the DLS is on. So all you have to do is just click, click revert, now it's fixed. So let's head back to Fortnite and let's see the fixed DLSS. Alright, so, so now, now I'm back, back in Fortnite, Fortnite. And, and now I'm going to be clicking, clicking on Battle Royale. Royale. So, so Going to my settings, and I'll be going to my settings. Right there. Now the character looks better than in my settings. Look at that. The three resolution can be changed, and the anti aliasing thing too. And you don't have to use the presets to raise it. So it's really convenient. And, and I'm going, going down. down. It, there's, there's no, no option, option to turn on the DLSS, DLSS, so it was clearly, clearly from the Razor Cortex. So if you found, found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe, subscribe because I don't, I don't know, because I want more, more subscribers. Alright, so see you guys in another video. Goodbye. Goodbye.